Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So this week I am back with another study with me as my last one was really really popular and I thought you guys might like to see another one. So I started off my day by washing my face as it just really wakes up my skin and then I got myself some breakfast so I got myself some hot cross buns because it is Easter and then I got myself some water because you guys know that it's really important to keep yourself hydrated when studying and then I just sat down and I put some makeup on because I felt like putting some on that day and also I don't know it just kind of makes me feel a bit more awake. So that day I really wanted to keep my outfit nice and comfy as it's easiest to revise when I'm comfy. So I popped on a jumper top and then some leggings and then I just got out all of the booklets that I wanted to revise from. So I got out my sociology booklet and then my binder and then I also got out some lined paper because I wanted to make some notes. Then I just got out my to-do list and I wrote a to-do list of the things I wanted to revise that day. This just helps me to make sure that I get all of the work done that I want to get done. In my last study with me, I featured some of my top tips for productive revision. I will link that down below if you guys want to go and check that out after this video. Then I just started off doing some work and the first thing I wanted to do was go through my Sociology Youth Subcultures booklet and just finish off my consolidation notes which I actually did in my last study with me but since then I had like finished off the booklet so I wanted to do that and while I did that I was watching some Netflix because I'm one of those people that I find it easiest to revise if I've got background noise on or something, it just helps me concentrate, I don't really know, but I just made some notes and then I used my highlighters to keep my notes really colourful as that's like the way that I like to revise. I had some mocks after Easter so I wanted to make sure that I was getting some work done. Then I actually went and had some lunch and I came back and I bought a snack, I got some grapes because if you know me you know that I love grapes and then I started doing my consolidation notes on the crime and deviance booklet which was the second booklet that is possibly going to come up in my exams after Easter so I just went over that and just made some notes and I used my colourful pens, highlighters, uh, basically just kept all my notes really colourful, I did some spider diagrams and yeah I just carried on revising. So then I got out my Mac and then I started to type up some of my notes for psychology. There are a lot of case studies that I have to cover in psychology, there's 20 which is so much. So what I do to help consolidate my notes and keep them all in one place is use a Google Drive document. So I will just type up all my notes from the booklet in my own words and then I'll print it off and revise from it later. So here I was just typing up my notes on the Blakemore and Cooper study and I got up some of the images to help me remember like the structure of the experiment and the way the cylinder was designed and I just did this for a couple of the studies that I hadn't updated my notes for as they were the ones that might have come up in my exam. And if you are also an A-level psychology student, you know the struggles and how like mentally challenging the subject is. I literally gave up right now, I was just so done with it. But you know, the grind must go on and the exams won't pass themselves. So I just got out my flashcards and I just went over the self-report experiments and correlations flashcards that I made for psychology. 
just for some light revision, you know, after a full day of revision. I needed to do a little bit more work, but I didn't want to do something that was going to be too mentally challenging and like draining anymore. So then I decided that it was time to just pack everything up as I had done a long day of revision. So I just packed up all of my revision and like just popped it back in the folders in the sections, keeps it nice and organised. So it was around 5.30 so I thought I would go and do some stuff that I like to do to keep me relaxed and kind of de-stress and unwind after a day of revision. If you guys do want to see that then make sure that you wait until my next video. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you're new and you like my content and you want to see more from me. Also go check out some of my other videos and follow me on my social media. Instagram and Twitter is on the screen somewhere and in the description box below. And I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye guys!